An embarrassing lesson for a teacher in Jefferson County. A student called our information center today when the documentary they were left to watch turned to porn. The district says it was an unfortunate accident, and we're not going to identify the teacher at this time because it doesn't appear anything criminal happened. But 9 News reporter Kevin Torres explains how it did happen. He's a wonderful teacher. It happened inside an eighth grade social studies classroom here at Bell Middle School. The normal teacher was away at a meeting, so his substitute popped in an assigned VHS tape about Rosa Parks. So his instructions were to show a portion of the tape, which he has shown for years, and then to stop it at a certain point because that's all really they needed to see. But that's not all they got to see. As the tape played on, it fizzled from a documentary into pornographic images. The teacher had absolutely no idea that these images were on that tape. He is devastated that the children in this class were subjected to this. The teacher has owned the tape for about seven years now and has always showed it to his class. How the pornography got on there remains a mystery. He has never seen the end of the tape. And it is a VCR tape, if that tells you how old it is. In the meantime, the district sent out a note to parents explaining the situation and saying they are looking into it. They also want to make clear it was not the teacher's fault and that the pornography certainly didn't belong to him. We would prefer that something like this not happen, and we very much regret that it did. For his part, the teacher says that he has never fully watched the tape all the way through, and he also says that he doesn't remember where he actually got the tape from. This is a lesson, though, Kim, for all the teachers out there, according to the district, that make sure that you know what is on your computers. Make sure you know what's on your tapes, your DVDs, and everything before it is seen in front of a classroom, because uh, they only received one complaint from a parent, but still it got the district a little bit razzled when they found out that pornography was being shown in a classroom, even if it was just for a couple of seconds. Mm, yeah, it's just very unfortunate. And as you mentioned, I mean, something like that happens in a classroom. Uh, things tend to get out quickly and people talk. Very quickly, very quickly. All right, thanks, Kevin.